found out if I wait on the Lord, he'll renew my strength. Said I wouldn't make it, but look at me. Y'all seen me last year, y'all seen me last year, rolling around in a wheelchair. Anybody know how it feels to get up from being blind and paralyzed on the right side? And now I'm on a walk and the doctor said, Paul, we don't understand it, but it looks like you're going to get off that walker because your bones are healing. Oh, I want it good. Can I sing a verse of my song? Hallelujah. God will heal. He'll make a way out of no way. Well, I'm feeling this thing. I know we on video, but I'm feeling it now. God will. He'll touch you with one finger and everything will be all right. Oh. I just want to ask you one question. Won't he make a way for you? Oh, y'all can do better than that. If you know he's been good to you, it's been enough pity patting for the Lord. It's been enough clapping, but what makes me so mad is when we go to the baseball game and the football game, we give Michael Jordan a lot of praise for what he's doing. But see, I believe that we do inside ourselves have a hero. Jesus Christ is your role model, is that right? It's been enough, pity Pat. Let's give God a big praise up in here. Like you know he's rich. This morning, I was feeling fine. But one touch, he touched my brain and my blood clot. Healed my body and closed me in my right mind. Lord, you gave me assurance. Wait, 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 wait down in my soul. You said, Paul, don't worry, don't worry. It's going to be all right. Everybody put your hand together and say, oh, no. y'all to get real quiet. My, 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 God will. Let me ask y'all a question right quick. Some of you are still looking at me strange, but I feel something right now. One question, and not those that know that we haven't always been like we are now. Yeah, I see the nice clothes and fine cars and the planes we flew in on. We are fortunate enough to buy a plane ticket. But I want to ask you a question. Can you think back on the days 
when you didn't have what you have right now. That's enough to say you've been good. But I got one special question, and if it embarrasses you now that you got a, a wad of money in your pocket, if it embarrasses you, don't say nothing. But I want you to think about how many times back in the past, or somebody dealing with it right now, you went to the mailbox. Oh, you ain't got to say nothing if you don't know what I'm talking about. And you're spreading your bills out on the table. When you reached in your pocket, you didn't have enough money to pay your bills. Don't be embarrassed of the person next to you. If you acknowledge what happened to you, God will bless you. Now, when you reached in your pocket, you didn't have enough money to pay your bills. But I want to see by the leap of some people up in here, and I just want you to jump up like popcorn if this applies to you. When you didn't have enough money to pay your bills, how many can jump up and say, but Paul, when bill time came around, somehow, 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 you know what? to go I see some witnesses standing up now because you just can't sit down when you know how good God has been to you now do me a favor can somebody by the hand can somebody by the hand look them dead in the eye now if you are for real Christian this ought to give you your joy before you walk out this elaborate ballroom I want you to shout out two or three things that you can think about that the Lord done for you. Go ahead, one, two, three, shout it out loud. Shout it out loud. Shout it out loud. Go ahead and go back. Go back. Go back to where you didn't have no money. Go back to when you got sick. Can you say? to worship him right there where you stand. This is the end. But I hear some mouth praise going on in here. Thank you, Lord. Didn't have to do it. You can go ahead. Clothes don't get important. Positions don't get important. Money don't get important when you just go back and think about you didn't have none of those things. But God saw fit to stop by your house late in the midnight hour when problems were bothering you the most. How many can say the Lord stopped by? And I told you, if you cry those tears, don't be afraid to let them out. God will made your tears. He'll wipe your tears. How many know he'll wipe your tears? How many know about weeping may endure for a night, but... Come! 